I'm showing you how to download Worst Plus 3, a outdated yet still incredibly powerful Crystal PvP tool. And of course it features the regular suspect of features as well. Anyways, to get it, you want to head over to their GitHub page, which is going to be linked down in the description below. Um, we just want to find the latest release over here, and then we want to download the Worst Plus 3 0.7.0. Now for this, you do of course want to have Forge installed for 1.12.2. If you don't have that yet, or you're not sure where to get it, then it is of course going to be linked down in the description below. Anyways, for right now, as you can see, I have Worst Plus 3 in my downloads over here, and we can put that in the mods folder for Minecraft. To get there, press on Windows and R at the same time, and then in the box that pops up, you want to type in App Data, hit Enter, or click on OK, and then you can... In this area, go into the folder called Roaming, then dot Minecraft, then scroll down until you find the mods folder over here. Inside of the mods folder, you simply want to drag the worst plus three mod, just like so. And once you've done that, we can close up both of these and open up the Minecraft launcher, and of course launch Forge for 1.12.2. Oh, also, if you're getting a virus detected error, then I will link that down, um, then I will link a bypass for that down in the description below. For right now, you can see that the file is safe to use. That was a public scan, by the way. <laughs> Anyways, here we have Worst Plus 3 with arguably one of the most unique um, Minecraft home main screens or whatever you want to call it. In terms of Minecraft clients, uh, the the fellas button over here brings you over to multiplayer. Anyways, right now we'll just head into a random single player world and briefly show you how to use this. So uh, yeah, we can see some information over here in the chat already. Um, anyways, this uh, client is mainly known because it features incredibly powerful Crystal Aura. Uh, crystal Aura, yep, you want to press on the right shift button, and that's going to pull up the click GUI over here. It's a little too zoomed in for me, so what I can do is go over to the video settings and turn down the GUI scale. And then, as you can see, now that is actually looking good. Um, Anyways, here you can see all the utilities that this client has. As you can see, as I said, it does have the usual suspects, basically all the things you would expect it to have. Um, kind of bare bones, but it does have a bunch of things that you would expect it to have, um, apart from, uh, of, well, some more specific things. Either way, we do, we do also have the uh, GUI over here, which you can fully customize, which is quite nice, as well as there being a full HUD editor here as well. Um, most of these do have some pretty nice customization. I suppose I should elaborate a little. You can turn on these here all on the utilities, click on them to turn them on, click on them once again to turn them off. Nothing has been turned on by default. Uh, and you can right click on them for a customization menu, which is what I've been doing. There, as you can see, this is also some customization menu for, in this case, the Jesus module. What does it do? I have no idea. Let's hover over it. It's Jeebus. Say hello to Jeebus. That's, of course, an incredibly clear description. I now know exactly what it does. Um, okay, so it, it, you get a description of exactly what the utility does uh, <laughs> when you're hovering over it. In my opinion, I kind of like Wars Plus 3. Um, it, it's, it's a funny client. I played with it when it, um, you know, was still recent, I guess. W, in, <laughs> in my opinion. Anyways, as I said, the Crystal Aura here... Um, the goods indeed it is incredibly powerful there's a whole bunch of customization that's what you're going to want to focus on with this client um the basically all of the crystal um pvp utilities that's what this client is really made for uh i think it's competing with phobos and stuff like that in terms of minecraft clients or at least it was back in the day um, it's by the way not sure if you guys know this uh but it's actually the the, the sequel of worst plus two uh that's some pretty crazy Minecraft knowledge there, isn't it? Uh, subscribe for that one. Um, <laughs> anyways, that was that, that was basically that, I guess. Definitely recommend checking out this client. It's uh, pretty interesting, pretty cool, um, for sure. For right now, though, if you have any questions or the like, do, of course, feel free to put those down in the comments below. Uh, but for right now, thank you ever so much for watching, and I do, of course, hope to see you again in the next one. Bye-bye.